Right, thought I'd do a wee vid about the motor cooling on the DF03, which is always an issue because it's captive inside the uh, chassis. You have the cooling bars available. Can't remember the part of the fan. That go there that are meant to go inside, but I was just uh, put them in the airflow. I don't know whether that's the right way or the wrong way. I'm sure you'll leave the. You tell me if you think I'm wrong. So what I have done is mounted the cooling fan. I've gone for the Centro C0651 BK. Uh, find that's the best one. It's, it's aluminium, so it's heats in anyway. Uh, Twenty-eight thousand RPM at five volts. It really is um, I'm only just over a ten or something. So not exactly bad ranking. Um, so I've run these on a few cars and do what they're meant to do. And you can get cheaper ones, but yeah, here you go. Um, got done mounted there what we'll do is take it off yes and i should have just gone on so go on. if you take that off you see that uh, uh countersink the into the aluminium so it's flush Run some countersink cap screws. Also opened it out there to let more air through. So rebuilding this, to, doing a rebuild on it anyway. So this is the new part, which is on part A. That must be the part number five eight three seventy. It comes on that sprue. What you need to do is take the centre off, which is for the body mount. So I've got another body, I'm going to be using a uh, Velcro around the side, uh, which eliminates that, eliminate that at the front. So I've got a new chassis, I'm going to do a rebuild on it anyway, as I say. Now I've rebuilt, I've took out the material from here, here and here, 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 here. Now this is primarily going to be a speed run car, so if I was going to use it, it ran uh, Castle 5.7 on 3S for years. I'd leave it as I would do the not take too much meat off, take enough to get a bit of airflow, but you still want the strength in that. Um, otherwise, you've only got a small bit on there and that bit there supporting the whole back end. So you should imagine it won't last too long if you start um, lemon it Kev Talbot or something. Um, so what you need to do say is first remove part of that and part of the screw uh, on the, the replacement part i've completely done away with that i've removed that and to move it down a bit better i'm thinking of moving take maybe grinding the corner of one of them off just so i can seat it neater what i'm planning on doing it is making it a lot neater because all i've done is fired a uh, tapped an M3 hole through the plastic and it's only held on by one screw. So I'm planning on doing four, either mount some captive nuts underneath or something like that really. There's that, that's that. Uh, kind of making the wiring tidier. So I say it's not really that neat. So I'm going to try and make it more factory. Um, and I'll see how I get on. <laughs> 